Well, a new TV series debuting nationwide this week features some homegrown talent, and he's repping his roots on that show. That's right. News for the Bronx reporter Amanda Bossard introduces us to him in this Best of the Bronx Report. Looking back at the basketball courts where he once played, Vladimir Camaño reflects on his journey from growing up here in the Bronx. You always have a nickname. You got a nickname, that meant you were cool. To appearing on TV screens all across the country. We were so rooted in what was going on that, like, you just wanted to smile because you loved the play so much. So, like, that was, uh, I think that's what kind of got me to comedy. The son of a Mount Eden building super from the Dominican Republic. 1515 over there. Is now one of the stars of a network television man. series. The, the actor shortstop. says it all started watching comedy greats and action movies alongside his older brother. What's up, baby? Frank. He's the, he's, the, he's the more GQ version of me. And I used to watch him laugh. And whenever he laughed, I was like, oh, I, I guess I should do this because I want to make my older brother laugh. After trying out stand-up while in college, Camaño kept at it during his first job as a high school counselor. Dad, what do you want? Mira, go to the Home Depot, tell them you want a two, three, four, five. Before long, the Bronxite was getting booked for comedy festivals and some cameos on TV. And over the last couple of years, I've been getting like little parts on Superstore, Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Marvel's Runaways. I did a movie called Vampires vs. the Bronx with Oz Rodriguez from SNL. And then uh, I got this show, Tommy. I play a cop on CBS called Abner Diaz, who's from the Bronx. He's from Mott Haven. Embracing his home borough on the silver screen. Bronx? Mott Haven. Hicksville. Hicksville. Alongside Edie Hicksville? Falco, who plays Tommy, the show is about L.A.'s first female police chief, who happens to be a New York transplant, just like Gamaño's character. It's not the first time the comedian tried bringing his Bronx roots. This is so New York right here. To television. Gracias, amigo. Now I sold the pilot to NBC about my life with my dad. It was called The Bronx Life. They unfortunately passed on it, but my dream is to one day bring it back. A dream that aligns with the advice he gives to all the kids growing up where he did. See your boy? To take it one day at a time, man. That's all you got. All you got is that one day. One show at a time, one part at a time, one scene at a time. And you can catch those scenes starting day. Thursday night Wesley, when Tommy premieres. In Mount Eden, Amanda Bossard, <laughs> News 12 The Bronx.